Hi there guys and welcome back to the final case of Dead Rising 4, case 6. Of course last week we found out exactly who Calder was and also escaped from the sewer. So uh, yeah, I believe it's now time to face Calder himself and hopefully get our camera back from young Vicky Chu. So let's get into it. Frank, what's happening? Vicky stole my camera! She has the evidence! What? Yeah, she does. Get it back! Great advice, Brad! What do you think I'm doing? Jesus. This isn't over yet, rookie! Screw you, Frank! Screw you, Vic. I won't lose her. I know exactly where she is. Come on! Give me why, are you, why are you serious? Shit! Nick! You've got yourself a big problem! I mean, another big problem! Oh, really? Yeah. Let's go. Come on. Where's she going? Ah, oh, now I'm. Damn it, Nick! Get lost, Parasite! We're done here! Parasite! Head upstairs. You can cut her off at Kitchero Plaza. Kitchero okay. Plaza? That evidence is mine. Oh no. Calder's not fucking around. Calder's so massive. Like he looks way more massive than what he probably should be. Vic. Oh dear. He's a bit of a poet, isn't he? I agree. I could do better. Tomorrow morning. Give me the camera back. I'm a new man tomorrow, I promise. You are part of the chain, Frank West. And I must break the chain. No. Do you get it? God, I hate you. However, that could be the suit that I'm about to use. Okay. You know what? You hurt my student. Took my story. And now you've blown up my favorite camera. So be it. Frank West was a zombie lord. Let's roll, weirdo. Yeah. Go all right, Vic? Vic! Where the hell are you going? You left me! Again! <laughs> I'm gonna need an exo suit, please. <laughs> Frank, can you hear me? Vic, where are you? Control room. How you doing down there? You all right? Ow! Did you punch me, prick? Head to the spa. I've opened the gate for you. That's a what? Yeah, I don't think a pedicure huh. is gonna help. Ooh! Exo suit. <laughs> now we'll have a fight. Yeah. Yes. Nice work, kiddo! We're ending this, Frank. Damn straight! I'll continue to fuck you. Okay, you keep hitting me like that. I'll punch you with these. Need some health. Yeah! Run away! Who's this? Oh. Yeah? Is he regenerating? Can he regenerate? He can drain power to recharge. I've seen him do it before. That is bullshit. That is not fair. Oh, he's decided he's charged now, is he? Right, I want to touch colder, not the zombies, please. Oh. 
Okay, mate, well. Ouch. Going. We're going to... Oh, I see. We just uh, stab these zombies with a fucking Christmas tree. Nice. And I threw him on the ground, but that's broken me thing. God damn it. Come on then, Colby. Yeah, thought you like that. Ouch. More shops for me. Let's go find these shops that are open. Electric power up, you love to see it. I'll keep fighting you, Golda. How many more times is he going to go recharge himself? Light him up, Vic! Enjoying yourself? Surprisingly! I'm cutting you off, asshole! Cutting him off for the final time, eh? I wish he'd stop fucking recharging. Come on, Vic. You can do it. It's <laughs> looking a bit, uh, a bit fried up there. Vic, sit, sit. Okay, you zombie son of a bitch. Time to ring in the new year. Fuck you, Colder. He's down. Okay. What now? Frank West, covered in blood. Seems to be a uh, a common common thing. Nothing will take the man. The chain remains. Ooh. Jesus. Plaza, I need medical assistance now. Okay, come on. Stay with me, kid. Stay with me. Despite everything that's gone on, he still cares. As I've said before, Frank West is not a bad guy. Easy, easy, slowly. Calder. It's okay. 
I got him. I got him. But we lost everything. Camera and Barnaby servers are wiped, and you blew the hard drive to a million pieces, so. <sighs> Hey, um, you weren't really gonna shoot me, were you? That was fatal. <laughs> well, like the leg? <laughs> yeah, I guess you could say that. Fair enough. I deserve that. But listen, if, uh, if it comes up again, you can aim for the right one. It's kind of a piece of shit anyway. <laughs> Frank. I'm really sorry about that. Don't worry about it. I've had worse. And so will you. That's kind of the shit you go through when you're a good journalist, right? What about being I don't a really journalist? what could be uh, worse What's than uh, what they've just went through there. Camera. You pulled it? Yeah. Before it blew up. Big coverage, big impact. Together, 50-50. Yeah, 50-50. I like the sounds of that. <laughs> ah. Plus mini golf. Oh man, not the mini golf. <laughs> yeah, <okay. laughs> mini golf. <laughs> <laughs> They'll actually go and play mini golf this time, eh? Wait, what? Well, now that you've sorted everything out, we need to get to the rendezvous point if we want to lift out of here. You don't have to tell me twice. Grab anything you need, and let me know when you're ready to go. Packing enough heat there, Butch Cassidy. Uh, I just fought a monster zombie lord. Did you... did you notice that? The monster zombie lord? I might have seen one. Just a little one. Let's keep killing these zombies. One last... Hurrah. Gal Willamette. Ground floor completely overrun. Head up. We'll get up to the sky bridge. Something tells me you've never been in a zombie apocalypse before, because you know that we can take <laughs> Come on. Think they're mad that we killed their daddy? <laughs> Probably just a little bit. We're meeting the helicopter on the roof of the parking garage. Just over the sky bridge. Let's oh, go. Good. Nice and convenient. Give me a second with the store. No, no, no. We don't have a second. Oh, dear. Oh dear. Holy shit! The zombies got him. We need extraction now. Now, damn it! Oh hell! We got company! Oh no, no, no! Go. Hustle! Hustle! Oh no, Brad, we'll be corner. We got supplies. We can make a stand here. So the next chopper can get zombie bombs? My people won't let us down. We're getting out of here. Stop. 
story intensifies, eh? Last bullet. So just keep shooting. I did not realize I could have made the last one. Let's go. It's a dead end. Ah, shit. I've seen how this movie ends. together a bit longer left as if we haven't already kept it together long enough get off him he's my friend Good, come on, come on. Whew. Is that it? Is the question. Looks like it. Come on. Jesus Christ. You never expect the hero to die. I forgot that Frank died at the end of this. <sighs> if Frank could have it his way, this is where the story would end. He'd die a hero, sacrificing himself for the good of his friends. You wouldn't need to follow it up to see the mess that unfolded in the months after. But Frank's not here to tell the story his way. He can't load it up with spicy embellishments. <laughs> Listening to his notes, I kind of wonder how this story would have gone when he told it later. Would he have defeated Fontana in single combat? Refused to conspire with the evil Dr. Blackburn? Added a sweet romance with the city engineer? I'm sure his second book would have sold as well as his first. But Frank's not here to tell his story. So he's got to trust me to do it. Whether he wanted it that way or not. And I say, the truth is better than fiction. Well, let's face it. She knows it way better than what he does, I guess. Okay, so that is it for Dead Rising 4. As always, guys, thank you for watching. If you have any feedback for me, please leave it in a comment below. And if you want to keep up to date with everything that I'm doing, including more Weird Wednesdays, then please subscribe. And I will see you next time.